left uh, San Carlos and we're heading to Buemos to pick up the rest of the team. Um, then we're going to have lunch there and then we're heading out to San Bernardo and uh, stay the night there and then tomorrow morning we're going to be going to Wajaray. Well, this is my first time going on the hiking trail. Oh, that's awesome. I, I, I and I'm going to be helping cooking um, and also translating and doing some other things. So it's going to be good. I hope. Um, <laughs> Seven days. <laughs> well, um, we're in Obregón and we're stopping for lunch at a fish taco place. And then we're heading out again to drive a couple more hours to a hotel where we're going to stay the night. I'm having two fish tacos. I don't really like fish, but... We are here in the mountains in Wajaray. Um, got here and they don't have all the donkeys, so they're going. There's some guys there like going looking for the donkeys. So we're gonna be. Plan was to leave today and walk all the way to Akinabo, but uh, it's gonna be taking a bit too long. Uh, to get the donkeys and stuff like that and yeah it's about a seven hour walk so we can't really stop uh, don't really want to walk in the dark so we're going to be starting tomorrow morning at seven so it's going to be a nice and early rise get to get up with the sun and the birds and yeah, it's nice and quiet here. Hey, we have been walking for two hours, two and a half hours from the first village that we were at and we're heading towards the second and it's all uphill mountain and downhill and I'm carrying this big pack. Lily and I are taking turns so um, it's kind of rough but it's really much fun. This is a purifier so we took water out of the river or I just barely did so I'm filling up my water bag. I emptied it in two hours. It's pretty warm over here. So. Now it's lunch time. Hi, we are now in... ¿Dónde estamos? Ajinabo. We are now in Ajinabo and we just took a swim. We are all kind of drinking coffee or hot chocolate and eating tortillas. This is a cookie fire behind and that's where they do all their cooking. It was really hot today and I rode the horse up the mountain and down. Oh, it was a meal. Rosie. 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 Oh. Oh. What did Rosie do? Rosie walked all the way, almost strong, I think. Well, she carried the pack for half the way. Actually, she did really good. She's most of the way. We took turns with our pack. It's nice and heavy. And yeah, it was really good. It was a nice hike. It was quite hot, but when we're crossing the rivers, it feels really nice. How are you doing, Becky? Good. <laughs> I'm just starting walking, so. <laughs> 
Hi. <clears throat> We've been walking all day through the mountains, like seven hours, I think it was. Um, traveling a lot. And then when we got to rest, it was in the shade. It was so nice because um, it was very, very pretty. <laughs> now we got to Babikura. Babikura. Two Christians here, as far as they know, but. Um, yeah, the group has only been here once. And even though it's so much walking to lots of stuff, there's still a store. Right now I'm filtering water so that we can drink. Um, this water looks pretty nasty, but we're about halfway to our location, to where we want to go to for the night. Well, today is day five and we're in Kuchuweri. I went for a swim before we got here, that's why I'm all wet. We dived off of a cliff, not dived, cannonballed. It was a lot of fun. <laughs> we stayed an extra day because we um, decided to show Faith like potatoes, and it was really good. I guess it was what God wanted because it was raining pretty much all day, and it's pretty muddy. First time ever for us. I bet they've had muddy stuff here before. We would have been walking in part of it. So last night we went up the hill in Kuchuwadi to pray for a family. Um, the man is 90 years old, and he loves the Lord. And it was really good for us to go pray for him and, and just to see his in, that he was encouraged. And uh, I was really encouraged. Um, I just really felt the Holy Spirit with us. Um, I feel like in my heart he was showing me um, to say to the man um, what God has been showing me. And that is that Yahweh is the same as he was from the beginning and he's still alive and he's still working and um, I just shared that with him and how um, he lived on the mountain with the Israelites and he still lives here on this mountain and uh, we get to experience him every day and uh, I'm really thankful for that I'm really thankful to experience that and uh, share that with with everyone here